What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Overlord here. Shout out to my Buffy the Vampire Slayer in this video here today. Now there's this never ending debate on who is better for Buffy related to these two characters, Angel and Spike. Previously both known as William the Bloody and Liam. Liam of course being Angel, William the Bloody being Spike. For me, I would have preferred Buffy ended up with Spike if we had to pick because truthfully, she needs a better partner to select besides these two. I think she deserves a lot better than this. However, what I mostly want to do in this video is go over these two characters and identify why one is better than the other and why these, to me, make them more of a better option for Buffy. So just to get it out the way up front, we already know if you're a diehard fan, you already are aware of this. Angel was cursed with a soul, Spike chose to get a soul. Angel was forced to go to hell to save the world. Spike chose to save the world. Just to start with Angel, I truly think that David Boreanaz shined better as Angelus in not only Buffy, but in his own series. Angel just became more interesting upon getting his own show. That version of the character just was nothing but a brooding, I guess you can say, I'll say, uh, handsome individual that Buffy was attracted to we know she, he was revealed to be a vampire and they had this relationship it did not work out so he left town but upon getting his own show I think we saw a lot more layers to the character of Angel but still in both series he seemed to be showing a lot more talent when playing Angelus so he became more interesting upon getting his own show like I just said now prior to Liam becoming a vampire he was shown as a drunk Nothing positive was happening in his life. His father could not stand him. And it's this wild child behavior that lands him in the grasp of Darla, who we know sired him into being Angelus. Buffy has always done a great job at highlighting that once the demon takes over, that is no longer the person with a soul because their soul is gone. But the demon has to navigate the vessel while retaining personality traits and tendencies and memories from its original human form. This is probably why upon becoming a demon, Angelus becomes one of the most decorated vampires of his era. Liam was already on a self-destruct path and seemed to lack respect as well. So then by infusing all that with a demon demonic presence, it only made him a much more vicious individual in his demonic form. Now, he ultimately bites the wrong person and Gypsy's curse him with a soul for punishment. Liam's soul is restored and he's for forced to accept responsibility for actions he did not commit. Because again, that was not Liam in control. It was the demon. A tragic circumstance, if you really think about it, uh, all of that, that really is a tragic circumstance. Spike's circumstances, though, are a little different. William is shown to have a positive relationship with his mother. He writes poetry, even though it was terrible. He's kind-hearted, but ridiculed by his peers and also doesn't seem to have much going for him. Still, his innocence is more profound than Liam's. We know William is ultimately sired by Drusilla and he joins her group for several years. Upon being sired, it's also clear that those do anything for love tendencies are still there when considering how Spike reacts to losing Drusilla and the desperate attempts he goes to get her back. Spike is also able to show more compassion because that's a trait that William thrived in. This is highlighted by how he still wanted to care for his ill mother. That's like the first thing that was on his mind that they need to go get their go get his mother. After spending several decades as a vicious vampire, Spike's demonic nature is sidelined due to military intervention that left him unable to perform the same. This is what, to me, allows that compassionate human personality to outshine the demon in control because he finds pleasure in doing what he can, like killing, de killing other demons, starts to develop feelings for Buffy, and even joins the Scoobies and commits some very heroic deeds without a soul because, again, the demonic nature was being sidelined and the human personality was able to become the pilot become more focused in the pilot seat than the demon itself that was taking control of the vessel spike also becomes so obsessed with buffy that he unfortunately tries to assault her in what i always interpreted as a final killing blow from the demon inside trying to do anything evil to satisfy that craving because the chip wouldn't allow it to spike chooses to become a better man after this by restoring his soul 
lives with guilt of everything he's done similar to angel similar to angel spike also dies to save the world however again as i pointed out earlier spike chose to do this angel did not spike isn't a perfect character but he is a better character than angel when considering those aspects that i just went over his death is also much more rewarding because it gave him a conclusion that william was present for after william's soul had been removed for over a hundred years there is something more 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 beautiful about his arc when compared to angel because william is presented genuinely as being someone who is an innocent individual who was just ridiculed by society unfortunately had their life turned upside down with a eternal kiss and was turned to the dark side his dark side was his never-ending path of course for the foreseeable future there was nothing that could have foresaw william ultimately taking control back of this vessel by the time this was all said and done but by the time william spike has his exit from the show he was the one who decided to go out of his way to get his soul back there was an inner struggle that was going on after that ship was placed inside related to his personality and the demon that was fighting to keep control of the vessel which ultimately led to the demon side being subdued enough to the point where he decided to go get his own soul or get his soul back it was restored william was back in control of the vessel he retained all the memories of everything this demon had done over the past hundred years or so they had that iconic scene in the ch in the church where he reveals to buffy that he has a soul and the realization when he when she recognizes that he's talking about his soul the, the spark i think he referred to it as one of the most chilling sequences in the series to this day spike for me with all of those characteristics in mind he is the better option for Buffy because I would say choices. Choices really are what the big difference is here for me between Angel and Spike. Choices. Spike chose to do two of the biggest things that are important for his character. Two of the biggest things that are important to Angel's character were not choices. They were forced onto him. I'm not saying that Angel isn't a good guy. <laughs> That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying that choices they do they too they do take better importance more significance over somebody cursing you and you just happening to get to stand somewhere to ultimately die and save the world and again prior to becoming vampires one seemed to be a better human than the other liam was on a self-destruct mission william seemed to have things together outside of you know he wasn't able to get a girlfriend uh he lived with his mother nothing wrong with that but you know he just had a little bit too much of a nice guy persona going on for him but he was still a, a stand-up individual compared to liam let me know what you guys think about all this down in the comment section below if you haven't already of course make sure you subscribe turn on post notifications that you never miss a video in the description i will have links on my social media accounts i am on facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course to let me know if there are any movies news or reviews you would like me to cover in the future and with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video